Destructive or aggressive chewing is something that can be found most often with beagle puppies that are in the teething phase but dogs of any age may display this behavior for a number of reasons. Before we move on with this video, you need to grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him, her. Link to the free, secret training technique, guide is in the description below. The products that I am going to mention in this video are up for grabs at discounted price. The link to the products is in the description below. Why Beagles Display Destructive Chewing Puppies, this begins around the 4-month mark and ends at around the 7-9 month mark but can continue to the 1-year mark in some cases. During this phase, there can be intense itching and discomfort which can trigger a pup to chew everything in sight. Habits established during this time, such as chewing on non-toy objects, can continue well into adulthood. Adults in most cases, continually chewing on non-toy objects is indicative of a self-soothing technique and shredding things often stems from feeling frustrated and bored. Is it possible to fully stop destructive chewing? In most cases, it is entirely possible to greatly limit this sort of behavior. And, in many instances, it can be complete resolved. The amount of success found in controlling a beagle's chewing really depends on how much time and effort an owner takes towards stopping this behavior. 6 Steps to Stopping a Beagle That Is a Destructive Chewer 1. Limit Your Beagle's Access It may seem too logical to even list here. However, many owners skip this step when it can greatly reduce problems seen with chewing. So, if your beagle is chewing on furniture in the kitchen, ripping up pillows in the living room, trying to gnaw on electrical cords in the den, and essentially shredding up the whole house, it's time to contain the damage. The best way to go about doing this is to create a defined space for your beagle, where you can, for the most part, control what is within it. Depending on the floor plan of your house and your beagle's age and jumping ability, options include setting up an indoor canine playpen or sectioning off a room via a safety gate. 2. Proof the house. Especially within the designated area that you've set up for your beagle, but also for any rooms that your guy or gal may be in, safety proofing should be done. This involves removing as many objects as possible that your beagle can reach that may be the target of chewing. This includes shoes, pocketbooks, gym bags, any clothing, books, TV clickers, etc. Find new spots for those things up high on shelves, in closets, or elsewhere. 3. Use a strong deterrent spay for unmovable objects. Most dogs dislike bitter tastes. Do keep in mind that this does not work for every dog. Some, for inexplicable reasons, either don't mind a bitter taste or are able to power through it to satisfy their chewing urges. Well, there's a better option that may be worth a try. While it was originally designed to be sprayed on paws and other areas of the body that a dog may gnaw at, Rocco and Roxy No Chew Extreme Bitter Spray has an exceptionally strong bitter taste and is safe to spray on just about any household objects including rugs and furniture. 4. Offer chew toys and treats for aggressive chewers for some dogs. Nothing short of a brick will withstand their strong jaws and uncontrollable chewing urges. However, for the majority of beagles, there are some chews and treats that can work very well. Let's look at some great choices. 1. The Onizel Durable Chew Toy for Aggressive Chewers. This simple-looking chew does very well in withstanding constant, strong gnawing. And, its bacon flavor and scent make it pretty enticing. 2. The Zogoflex Interactive Treat Dispensing Toy for Aggressive Chewers. This is made of a very dense material specifically to satisfy strong chewers. It's exceptionally durable and its design as a treat release toy makes it appealing. You can fill this with dry snacks or kibble, mixed up with mashed bananas or peanut butter. 3. A Whole Elk Antler Dog Chew by Chipper Critters. Moving away from traditional chew toys, this is worth checking out. As you probably know, many bones are dangerous to give to dogs. But, canines love chewing on bones, mostly drawn in due to their consistency and the bone marrow found within them. And, this is where real elk antlers come in, providing the qualities of bones while doing so in a much safer way. 4. A Pack of Himalayan Yak Snack Dog Chews. 
One resolution to satisfy dogs that love to chew is to offer a long-lasting snack. Instead of a treat being gobbled down in under 10 seconds, it lasts for up to 20 minutes. And, these yak treats are just the thing for this. 5. If your beagle rips up pee pads, modify or replace them. It's common for teething pups or even adults to rip up their pee pads. This can make a huge mess and leave completely upend your house training plans. Fortunately, there are some options to either modify the existing pee pads or replace them, that even compulsive chewers won't be able to destroy. 1. If you want to stay with pee pads, using a tray like the Ritual Paw Tracks Mesh Training Tray can be a great help. This one snaps the pads into place with a full cover to that makes it impossible for the pad to be reached. 2. Another option is to move away from pee pads completely and one way to do that is with a grass patch. These are awesome for beagles that are used to going to the bathroom outside and are much more likely to be used when indoors. 6. If you see it happening, redirect chewing and reassess. Implementing as many of the previous tips as possible will greatly limit any destructive chewing. However, there may be times when your beagle slips through these preventative methods. If so, be prepared for this. The goal for reacting to chewing is to 1. Gain your beagle's attention 2. Redirect your dog's focus elsewhere, and 3. Reassess what went wrong. Let's look at each of these steps. 1. For gaining your beagle's attention, for some dogs, a loud hand clap along with a firm, no, or saying the dog's name will work. However, if bad chewing habits have been in place for some time, your guy or gal may be so used to hearing, no, that it has little meaning. If you find that this is the case, you may want to step things up a notch. There are a couple of ways to do this. One is to place a handful of coins into a metal jar, a few quick shakes can work well enough to interrupt. 2. To redirect, the moment that you have your beagle's attention, which you should assume will be very temporary, immediately offer something that is of higher value than the object that your dog was chewing on. This should be your focus, rather than trying to discipline your beagle or attempt to explain why the chewing was, bad. 3. Reassess what went wrong. If your beagle was ripping up newspaper, gnawing on your favorite sneakers, tearing apart pee pads, chewing on your remote, etc. For teething puppies and for some adult dogs, chewing urges can be exceptionally strong and in fact, nearly uncontrollable. Your beagle needs your guidance to direct this in a healthy manner and requires your help to stay safe and keep the house from being damaged. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the Secret Training Technique Guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the Little Paws Training channel if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.